what they used to do in Rajasthan because view is what a lot of people pay for actually. Welcome to Lila Palace Hotel. Today I'm showing you the tour of this beautiful hotel because I really want to share how amazing and fantastic it is. It is based on the lake and the main entry to the hotel is through the lake. So you have to take a boat for another very exceptional experience and takes about 10 minutes. What I really love about this property it is that it is modern property. It's been actually built in 2009. I remember that year because that's the year my daughter was born. So it's 15 years old and it's still very very nice and new and it's got very contemporary feel to it yet very royal and luxurious feel to it so i'm going to turn the camera around and talk you through about what's in the room and what gets given within the stay at lila so as you walk out on your left hand side you're going to find that there is a wardrobe space where you put your luggages and hang your clothes if you wanted to. You can also take this out and put your luggages on top of that, depending how many luggages you have. We have two luggages and when we open them, they are still comfortably sitting amongst each other. Uh, in here, you've got a safe, which actually works. This is a bonus, not every safe works in every hotel room. But this one does. You get given two complimentary slippers. I really like Lila slippers. And there's a yoga mat. I actually this morning used it to go to do my yoga. There is a shoe mitt and also a shoe wash, shoe polish. Uh, the iron wasn't here in the morning, but we've requested it because I needed to iron something. And also there is a scale. That's where we keep our shoes and you've got plenty of mirror spaces. So once you put your outfit on, you can check yourself out. Looks good. Right, <laughs> let's move forward to the bathroom. So in here you got those beautiful double door. And when you open it, you see the bathroom with his and hers sink. So in the bathroom, we get given a lot of complimentary gifts. It's our second night, guys, so we're already settled in. So it's really like all our belongings are all over the place, but they have just done a room service and they've cleaned it up for us. And we've been for an hour, boys went swimming out. So I thought i will quickly shoot this for you guys. So there is a comp given. And here you've got some earbuds, although we finished them. Some face towel, shaving kit, shower cup and cum. And yeah, there is soap as well, which we opened up already. And here you've got a shower room, which is very nice and comfortable. I have had shower this morning and you can set up to massage or you can just have a handheld towel shower if you like. And on the other side of the bathroom, you have a toilet. I'm not gonna talk much about the toilet. And right opposite the bathroom is a bathtub. And it's quite a big room and it's got massive bath. Yesterday, guys, it took about half an hour to fill up the bath and it wasn't yet fully filled. And I had such a nice and relaxing bath. Guys, I don't have a bath in the house and having a bath once in a while, it really is a blessing. But if you see here, uh, you can easily see into the room. So there is one set of curtains and also right here are the buttons which if you press, will close the curtains. So you have a close the curtain button and you hear the noise because right behind me, the curtains are closing. That's it. And now you've got privacy and no one can see from outside that you are having a bath. Let's just close the app and move on to the main part of the room. So if you close it all up, actually, the wardrobe and the bath and the bath, room or shower room i should say it looks really nice and like open so right here what i love is that it's got big desk and yesterday i was sitting down working on my laptop editing my videos yes guys i do work despite being on holidays this is my full-time job already doing the youtube thing there is some complimentary water given and also this cute elephant and yes these are the curtains i was talking about so you can close them and then completely close up there or give a privacy to the bathroom. Now these are not actually door guys, these are the art walls. So in here you've got this mirror, this is very very popular in Rajasthan. So back in the days when there was no light or there was no electric lights, 
what they used to do in Rajasthan, they used to put a mirrors together, like broken mirrors or particles of mirrors together into like some sort of designs like this. And in front of that, they would put a candles and those candles will illuminate or the mirrors will illuminate the light of a candle making the room more bright and lit up exactly same design is on the other side it looks actually like there is a door behind but there isn't actually it's just a nice wall art and let me just put the lights on because then we're gonna have a better view that's the bed it's a double bed but we fit here with our little one and they've also brought a spare bed for us so that Arjun can sleep on it they've already been jumping on us so that's why it looks so creased despite them already making the bed up you have a little sitting space here and also in there and that coffee table was actually here before they put that big bed there obviously because we've got additional person in the room we have to have a bed for them and there is a little sofa there a big TV there's also a bar and in here if you wanted to make yourself teas and coffees and have some things off the bar you could just help yourself with it I believe it is paid I don't know my husband's been having some drinks so we'll find out later and here you have milk for teas and coffees and some complimentary drinks as well and what's in there oh yeah that's teas and coffees so if you wanted to make yourself a drink that's where it is since we've already spent one night in here, I can tell you the night was fantastic. We were tired of the travel, but we've had amazing night's sleep. The bed is very comfortable, it's bouncy, but yet yeah, firm enough for you to have a good night's sleep. The cushions are nice and soft, and it was really comfortable to have a good night rest. If you enjoy what you're seeing, don't forget to press that subscribe button and like on the video because that really helps me grow my channel. It doesn't cost you anything, but I spend a lot of time and energy creating those videos for you. So don't forget that subscribe button, like and comment. Thank you. And the one last thing that I want to show you guys is the view because view is what a lot of people pay for actually to have a really nice beautiful view. So we have a view that faces towards the part of the hotel and also towards the lake. Have a look guys. absolutely amazing and in the morning I love opening the curtains and just looking outside the window because I do enjoy that beautiful view what do you guys think now one thing that I want to compliment Lila on is the excellent customer service whenever you pick up the phone and call the reception they delivering whatever you need whether that's shower gels towels water we've asked for extra bed it's been delivered like literally within seconds like honestly they're standing outside the door just listening what you order and they bring it over to you because they're just so quick to respond to your needs because they really want to make sure that you're staying happy and comfortable as much as possible and the same goes for the food the food is amazing we just had lunch and i'm still continuing my healthy diet and i'm not saying i've not eaten healthy but i've eaten loads because the food is amazing the desserts are so good that's okay i mean i'm on holidays three days that's okay i'm sure it's not gonna really that much affect me although i can feel that the waist is already expanding <laughs> never mind so yes what i wanted to say that when they serve portions and today the occupancy is less than 70 percent in a hotel this is why they've actually served food from a la carte having said that you can order whatever you want from a la carte within the full board package and we have ordered a lot of food it was amazing and also the portions that bring us so big and we've asked why your portions are so big this is you know lunch so people will not have to eat so much and they said we just want to make sure that the customer comes out of the restaurant having full tummy so this is the idea they just want to make sure that you eat a lot and you're not hungry when you walk out the restaurant so just a little bit earlier today i have filmed the tour of the um, hotel as well so i want to take you out to show you a little bit more about the property because there is a lot to see so come along guys and i hope you enjoy
some of the kids they also do this like for just to worship and everything. Oh. Okay. And uh, over here, it is the whole family of Lord Ganesha, like Lord Ganesha, their wives, Riddhi, Siddhi, uh, Lord Shiva, and her his mother Parvati. Nice. Thank you. This is your courtyard. Yes, this is kept. This is the inner courtyard. We saw the Rajasthani dance happening yes, here last night. It's beautiful. Yes. Yes. The art you will see on the wall, it is the Kikri art. The mirror art, it is a purposefully broken mirror art. Okay. Uh, it is also broken from Rajasthan. When there was no electricity in Rajasthan, the people used to paste these mirrors on the wall and they used to take up a diya. The candle, this is all marble. And also it has uh, its QB and everything. So this umbrella takes one and a half months, is made by hand and is made of material and it costs the company six lakh to just purchase one check umbrella. The inside of the umbrella also. Beautiful. Wow. Look at that guys. This orange one. Mm -hmm. So it is the Jodhpuri sandstone from Jodhpur. Jaipur. Jodhpur. Jodhpur, okay. Yes, and the chairs we have here, the two chairs. Yeah. It is also made up of teak wood and silver plated. Uh, that was also place. from the king's side. Mm -hmm. They much uh, remind me of a queen's and yes. king's chairs. Yes, same in the rooms. Yes, we've seen that on the doors, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, calm dhenu in India. Because yes, calm dhenu. It is the like a holy cow. Uh, and it is like a goddess of all the powers in India. Art of Udaipur Hindu. This is the block painting. Like they make the whole painting and then they divide it in two parts so it looks like a block painting. So it is showing a carrier going on. So uh, when the king used to go for war or something like that, like, or for some events, not much, but uh, this part is very lit up. Like we have some lamps over here, uh -huh. so it gets lit up at the night. Mm -hmm. And we place candles also here. These are peacocks, right? Peacocks? Yes, those are peacocks. This is the library bar. The concept of library bar came after our late campus education. Man. Like, we were very fond of reading books while having the drinks and everything. So, after that, we got into the concept of library bar. Nice. This bar shows the royalty of the Rajasthan and everything. This hookahs. Over here we have some shields, some helmets. So these are some old, like old helmets of the kings and everything. Mm -hmm. Soldiers as well? Yes. A lot of history. So that that's actual library that's part of the library. <laughs> And you can take the book out and read? Yes, definitely. Mm -hmm. What sort of books do you offer here? Most of like some... Historical? Encyclopedias are there. British Government of India. Encyclopedia, yeah. Papers of all nations. This is probably my favorite part of the property. It's so beautiful, the view, everything. So this is the outdoor courtyard of our palace. Mm -hmm. So that's the whole view of the palace yes. outside. And uh, okay, uh, we, most of the parts we have, like we are around like 22 water bodies we have in our palace. Oh wow. So we have to go and see the water bodies. This is the first of them.
garden. In the Shi when this place was first discovered, it had full like garden of guavas, so they only kept this part. So that we have some heritage. Arjun's running towards me. Hi Arjun. Oh damn yeah. Well, they do yoga in the morning. I did my yoga here this morning. It's really beautiful. Look at the view. I just cannot get enough of view. You've got mountains, you've got water. It's just beautiful. Just on top of the terrace, look at the view here. This is like the highest point of the property. And I'm going to take you now to another special point. Look how beautiful this looks. So I hope you guys enjoyed the tour of this beautiful property and the room as well. Lila Palace, it truly is amazing and very luxurious property and I would really recommend if you can to come and stay at least one night because it's a magical place. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you soon. Bye bye. If you are enjoying the content that you're watching, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that like button and also tell me in the comments below what about this property you love the most. Thank you.